Our task is to create a world where violence is not the norm, but rather love, understanding, and respect. Activism is a lifelong journey. We must never grow complacent, but always strive for a more just and equitable society. Do your little bit of good where you are. It's those little bits of good put together that overwhelm the world. You are a child of God. Your playing small does not serve the world. We must reject the notion that some lives are more valuable than others. Every life is precious and deserving of dignity. You don't choose your gifts. They are God-given, and they are there to be used for others, for your sisters and brothers. We must build bridges of understanding and empathy to dismantle the walls of inequality. Injustice anywhere is a threat to justice everywhere. We cannot turn a blind eye to the suffering of others. Violence may seem powerful in the short term, but it is love and forgiveness that have the ultimate power to heal and transform. Human rights are not a privilege to be earned. They are an inherent dignity that belongs to every person. The fight for equality is not limited to one cause or one group. It is a collective struggle for a better world. The path to peace begins with recognizing the humanity in each and every person. The struggle for equality is not a burden. It is a privilege to stand alongside those who are marginalized and fight for their rights. Every person has a role to play in the fight for equality. No contribution is too small. Equality does not mean sameness. It means recognizing and celebrating our differences while ensuring equal rights and opportunities for all. Human rights are universal. They apply to all people, regardless of race, religion, or nationality. If you want peace, you don't talk to your friends. You talk to your enemies. Don't raise your voice, improve your argument. Peace is not possible without justice, and justice is not possible without respect for human rights. Human rights are not a luxury for the privileged few. They are a necessity for all. The time is always right to do what is right. Activism is not about being comfortable. It is about being willing to disrupt the status quo for the sake of justice. I am not interested in picking up crumbs of compassion thrown from the table of someone who considers himself my master. I want the full menu of rights. Violence is not the solution to our problems. It only breeds more violence and suffering. Our activism should be guided by love and compassion. It is the driving force for lasting change. Change does not happen overnight, but it starts with a single step. Take that step and keep moving forward. Violence is a disease that can only be cured through love, compassion, and understanding. You don't choose your family. They are God's gift to you as you are to them.
Activism is an act of love, love for justice, love for equality, and love for humanity. We can be human only in fellowship, in community, in koinonia. No one is born hating another person because of the color of their skin, their background, or their religion. People must learn to hate, and if they can learn to hate, they can be taught to love. Equality is not a privilege. It is a fundamental human right that must be fought for and protected. Our unity is our strength. Together, we can create a more just and inclusive society. We were made to enjoy music, to enjoy beautiful sunsets, to enjoy looking at the billows of the sea. Human rights are the foundation of a just society. Without them, we are all vulnerable to oppression and injustice. You are a prisoner of hope, so smash all your glass ceilings and fly. There can be no peace without justice, and no justice without respect for human rights. The struggle for equality is not a battle against individuals, it is a battle against systems of oppression. Activism is the rent I pay for living on this planet. My humanity is bound up in yours, for we can only be human together. Activism is not a sprint, it is a marathon. We must stay committed for the long haul. Activism is not a choice, it is a responsibility. We have a duty to fight for justice and equality. Hope is being able to see that there is light despite all of the darkness. Activism is not about winning popularity contests. It is about standing up for what is right, even in the face of adversity. We need to be reminded that we are all brothers and sisters. Our diversity should be celebrated, not used as a reason for discrimination or violence. We are made for goodness. We are made for love. We are made for friendliness. We are made for togetherness. We are made for all of the beautiful things that you and I know. We must stand up against injustice and oppression, for silence in the face of evil is itself evil. The use of violence to achieve political goals only leads to more suffering and division. Human rights are not negotiable. They are the foundation of a just and compassionate society. We must speak up against injustice, even if our voices shake. Silence only perpetuates oppression. God's dream is that you and I and all of us will realize that we are family. To deny people their human rights is to challenge their very humanity. We are the product of a loving God who cares about all that we do. We must be relentless in our pursuit of justice and equality for the sake of all humanity. Forgiveness says you are given another chance to make a new beginning. True peace is not merely the absence of tension, it is the presence of justice. Our differences should not divide us, 
they should unite us in our shared humanity. Justice is not a distant dream. It is an achievable reality if we stand together and demand it. Change begins with small acts of resistance. Each action, no matter how small, contributes to the larger movement. Violence can never bring lasting peace. It can only perpetuate a cycle of pain and suffering. We must never forget that the rights of every individual are sacred and must be protected. Never underestimate the power of a small group of committed individuals to change the world. We must continue to push the boundaries of what is possible and challenge the status quo. Our common humanity binds us together and compels us to fight for the rights of all people. Our duty is to shine a light on injustice and work tirelessly to create a more just and equal society. Stand up for what is right. Even if you are standing alone, it is better to be on the right side of history. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button and leave a comment. Click the subscribe button to get more videos like this one.